You too. Okay. <sighs> I get jealous too. I'm not gonna sit here and lie. Let me just be open and honest for a second. I'm not gonna make a video like this again for a while. But if you catch it, you catch it. If you don't, you don't. You know, I get on Twitter quite a bit. And I'm never too upset, you know, what, what I'm looking at. But sometimes it bothers me. I get upset at watching other people who succeed. Because I know I'm a new streamer. You know, I'm, I've never been on Twitch. I've never been on Kick. And, uh, but I was a YouTube streamer for a while. But it sucks because my whole channel, that whole channel is gone and everything. So it's like I kind of disappeared, right? Nobody knows who I am. I wasn't a big YouTube streamer by any means. Um, and it sucks to see people who have already, you know, done the due diligence, come over to kick and just get verified within like a couple months. And it's no fault of their own. It's not, it's not like they hadn't put in the work because the people I'm seeing are people who've been on Twitch for years, you know, two, three years. That's consistency. But it just sucks because it makes you, it makes me, it's just, I, I, I know for me, it's going to be impossible for a while for me to be able to reach the people I want to reach. There's times I have 10 people in here. There's times I've had 20. There's times I've had 30. And I've had I've had a thousand people in here at once. Maybe a glitch, but it happened. <laughs> um, but you know. I just know that the topics I do and the fact that I'm just unknown, even though in my head I feel like I'm known. But even I'm unknown to this world. And I just know it's gonna take me a good while to get to that point where people are used to seeing my face. It's going to take, and it sucks because I know what it's going to take. It's going to take a shout out. It's going to take somebody noticing me. And I hate that. Um, because that's just how it works today. That's how kick is going to work. Kick is going to work for people knowing who you already are. Or if you're unknown, it's going to take somebody big to shout you out. And I don't want that. You know, I want to just get there on my own. But I know, I know that's just the way the game works. So, I mean, I'm not going to ask for no shout out. I'm never going to go to somebody, but hey, can you shout me out? No. If it happens, it happens. If it don't, it don't. I love doing what I do. I love educating how I educate, man. I think about my live streams outside of here because I know I have to keep my intent. Oh, appreciate it. Uh, I know I have to keep my integrity up. Hold on, guys. I'm making sure my thing is still good. Dropped a few frames there. I always I stay on top of that. Thank you. But, you know, I know it's going to take some time for somebody to finally find me. And that's just how it's going to have to rock. And it's how things are going to have to shake out. And it's people. <laughs> it's just people I don't even know who get verified that have to watch Kick. And I don't know Kick is doing what they're supposed to be doing. I understand. It's just like. Because I guess I'm just, I'm not jealous. I'm not jealous of people getting those things. I'm jealous that I didn't stay. I'm, I guess I wouldn't even say I'm jealous. I'm upset and disappointed with myself. Um, because I know it's just not my time. But I could have done this years ago, but I was just wasn't into cars. You know, I just had a girlfriend, had other things going on, had a full time job, going to school, and I just, couldn't do it like that you know when I wasn't at work or doing school I was with my girlfriend at the time and I focused a lot of my time on that at the beginning you know how it is when you first get a girlfriend and so I had to focus my time there I mean I worked so much it's just like I didn't have time to do stuff and when I finally got to the weekend you know I just didn't want to do anything you know what I'm saying you work all day you just kind of like you know you want to chill on the weekends <sighs> and now I got all the time in the world you know even even with my homework, you know, I get my homework done pretty quickly now because it's getting towards the end of the year. So, you know, you're, you're just getting a bunch of tests and having to finish projects. So my homework goes by pretty quick. I can do my homework in a couple hours, you know, each day. But uh, I just don't I just want to, you know, guys, I'm going to say this. If you ever notice on my YouTube 
even when I've started a new series and I have to start back over, right? I have to start completely back over, right? I have to all do all my videos all over again because I deleted all of them, right? So all my videos are gone. And so I'm having to redo every video. Well, you notice that if you go to even what can I smoke or especially what can I change, you notice I upload pretty, I, I upload pretty, um, I'm gonna try to say, I upload, I update quite a bit. I upload quite a bit. Um, a lot of times, I mean, I, I upload at least five, six videos a day, a week. I also, on what can I smoke, I upload about five videos a week, plus the shorts. And on my Instagram, I've gotten way more active um, as far as my workout videos. And I've been better with the live streams, been getting the smoke videos out. It's just the reason I do that is I try to build a catalog because consistency is what's going to make you overtake most people. You know, now sometimes your content is just not going to be there. You know, some I'm just going to be honest, like me as a regular person who talks topics compared to somebody who does more viral stuff, maybe pranks or interviews and stuff like that, they're going to do better than me. It's just how it is. Or, so if you know, me making videos or a girl who gets on there and shows her nipples, I'm not going to be able to compete with that. Um, just is what it is. But my main focus at this point is consistency. I know that's going to at least help me get where I need to be. I don't really care about the numbers. I care about the engagement. You know, I want to know that people are, uh, that I'm actually getting through to people and, what I'm saying matters because I don't make these videos just for you guys. I make them for myself. If you guys don't know, I, w I watch my own videos. Um, and if I, <laughs> if I didn't like making my videos, if I didn't like my videos, I wouldn't make them. But a lot of the times I get something out of my videos cause I actually listen to myself. Um, but at the same time, you know, I just haven't been consistent over the years and it just makes me upset that I didn't do that. I had ample opportunities but something always ended up happening. I always got caught up in some, honestly, I always got caught up in a woman. The last two times I disappeared off of YouTube is because I got a girlfriend. And I hate that that happened. I mean, the last three times. I got a girlfriend, a girlfriend, and then a wife. And all those three times I disappeared from YouTube. And I hate that I did that because if I would have stayed consistent, I'd be decent right now. But I didn't. Um, and then I was really consistent with my smoke channel at first. And then I let it go, obviously, for nine months until last month I, did, I started putting videos up again. And <sighs> it just sucks because you lose subscribers. You ain't going to get the views you get. YouTube makes me disappear because I'm a smoke channel. And you just get, I just get pissed off. It's like, <sighs> if I had just been consistent and I get jealous of people who were consistent. I would say, once again, I'm saying jealous because that's a simpler way to say it. But honestly, I'm just disappointed with myself and I just I know I got to do this you know and I, this time I'm not going to stop I'm not going to let my I'm not going to let things get in the way this time you know once I get done I'm still doing school and once I get done with school I'll have even more time you know and I'll, I'll, I'll have a job that's making more money and so then I can you know put more resources into these videos you know um, mainly smoke stuff what can I change I really don't have to invest any more money because I've already bought all my workout uh, stuff and I've already bought the PC and I've already bought this mic everything I need for what can I change is done but I'm going to be working on what can I smoke as I continue to collect um, y'all can't see it as I continue to collect you know bongs and whatnot. you can't see the pipes so I'll, I'll, I'll show those later when we do the smoke session but you know it's and another thing for me it's an investment you know I've always Every a lot of the money I make, guys, you might not ever see me like you don't see a lot of the stuff that I put money into that I invested into for these these channels. I don't really care if I ever get paid to do this stuff. I don't care about the money. I don't that I, I'm going to school to do something that I want to do. I don't care about the money on these channels. I care about my reach. That's what I care the most about. And that's what I get upset with myself about because I could have reached so, so many people by now. And I feel like Sometimes, and there's good streamers out there who give great messages, who are doing great things that are out there. There are big channels out there that teach great stuff. And I'm just mad I'm not a part of it. You know, I want to be part of the group. I want to be part of the the, the message of positivity and um, teaching people about um, 
loving themselves and teaching people not to look at porn and teaching people not to be aggressive and teaching men about, you know, uh, the way we treat women and vice versa, you know, uh, treating men, how, you know, teaching men how not to be, don't let yourself be stepped on by women and just everything I can. And I feel like it's my own fault that I don't have the reach that I do, but I am no longer going to make excuses. I'm just going to do what I'm supposed to do because I do believe I, I have a purpose of doing this education thing. And it's it, to me, it's just about reach. The more people I can get to, the better. Um, and so that's going to come down to me putting in the work. I appreciate that, Motar. So anyway, yeah, that's pretty much it, man. I'm not doing too many. Uh, normally I do two topics a night, but I really don't have too much on my heart tonight. And it's already nine. You know, it's already getting late. Well, it's, I guess it depends on where you live. All right, so we're going to go ahead and get into the smoke session in a little bit. Um, but for you two, I love y'all. We'll have more topics tomorrow. Well, doesn't matter. Y'all get... Yeah. On YouTube, I upload the topics one at a time. So, but it's so funny. I just want to say this before I leave. For you people who are watching this on YouTube, if you made it this far. By the time you guys see one of my topic videos, it's been about two weeks. By the time you see a video that I've up... if Let's just say, the, the video I just uploaded on YouTube... I think I made that seven, seven to seven, probably seven to 10 days ago. And I like that. That's what I like. If you, if you're going to do YouTube and all that, just, just, just make sure you make a catalog of videos. So if anything happens, you can just schedule all your videos to release often. That way you're always at least two to three weeks ahead. So if you go on a, you know, if you go on vacation or something, you have videos ready to go. And that's what I do. Even with my smoke videos, people are seeing my smoke videos but I made those I made those videos like a week and a half ago, and I like that. And, there, and there's nothing that stresses me out more in, than not having videos ready to go. And that's kind of why I live stream. That's also something I um, am proud of myself about. Now that I live stream, I can crank out videos easily because I live stream the majority of my topics. You know what I mean? And so even though I may not be getting uh, a ton of people in my streams, I'm still getting. I'm, I'm not gonna lie let's just be honest i'm only getting like 18 views a video but that's a lot for me you know that's a lot for me uh, i'm for a long time on youtube i didn't get any views i have some i have some videos that got up quite a bit of views got some views when i was at my peak but now that i disappeared and came back again you know 18 views is a lot for me you know one day that 18 hopefully will turn into 100 views my goal is to get about 500 views a video. I could be happy with that. You know, I don't ever expect to make, I don't ever expect to get 100,000 subscribers. I don't expect to ever get um, even 10,000 subscribers. Not on what can I change? What can I smoke, obviously? But I don't expect what can I smoke to get to 50,000 subscribers. It is where it is. I don't expect either of those channels to ever be a big channel. I don't care about that. I just want the reach. If I can get five, if, if I could get 500 views, a video and that's 2,500 views a week I could be happy with 10,000 views a month I'd be happy with that on both channels so um, that's my goal but for right now we're gonna start small goals my goal right now is to only get 20 views a video um, and work my way up from there it's just a, it's just a goal you know it's not about money it's not about being the best because those things I'll never make more money than certain people and I'll never get as many views as certain people. But if I reach my goals, it's all worth it. Okay. Anyway, we're about to get ready for the smoke session. Uh, YouTube, peace, kick.